you, your wife, and your kids, um, the pictures that you put up, you are a family man. Wrestling is second to you. You are a family man that, you know, those girls always come first in your eyes, and you can see that at any time that you talk to you. Yeah, and, um, that, I mean, they're the reason that uh, I'm, I, I keep going because, to me, you know, growing up telling everybody I want to be a ring announcer for re- pro wrestling, I'm going to be in a wrestling ring, ring announcing, you know, a lot of people laughed at it, and a lot of people told me that it would never happen. Um, it wasn't all negative, obviously. There's a lot, just as many people that told me I could do it and I would do it as there were people that told me I would never do it. Um, but for me, I mean, it, I, I, I work with one of the biggest companies in the world. I've gotten the opportunity to travel for the last four and a half years to uh, multiple states, countries, and I've gotten to ring announce in the middle of the ring at Madison Square Garden. So to me, you know, I, I've lived my dream. I am living my dream, but You know, my daughter's about to turn six. Uh, When she gets to the age that she decides that she wants to do something and she decides that she has a passion for something, I want her to be able to look at me and say she can do what she wants to do because her dad went after his dream and accomplished it. So for her to see that it is possible that close to home, because, yeah, her you know, family and teachers and all that, they're going to tell her that she can do it. But for her to have an example like that, you know, it, it keeps me going on days that I'm gone for three and four days. And that's another thing, too, is, is my wife, man. You said my wife, you, she tolerates it. I can say that much. Um, <laughs> she does. I see her at IWC. Yeah, you know, she tolerates it. it she, yeah, she goes to the IWC events, and it's. I feel so bad for her. Like I said, I was gone for four days a couple weeks ago. Now she's home with the girls. Like, that's all her. So, um, you know, my parents help out. Her parents help out. But for the most part, um, you know, that's her. And I, <laughs> I honestly feel like the reason that she tolerates it so much is because I wanted to do this when we first got together. She's been with me before I started any of this, when I was still aspiring to – just stand in a wrestling ring and announce one time. You know, she was there when I got a letter back from so-and-so company telling me I wasn't ready or, you know, so for her to see me doing it and seeing me live that dream, it's different for her. Whereas I feel like if we got together now, I feel like if I just started a relationship now, it'd be so hard, you know, and I feel like a lot of guys go through that. You know, you, you, get a new relationship with somebody and oh this weekend uh, i'm going to be gone all weekend oh hey i want to take you to meet my parents next saturday we're doing oh sorry i I, i'm going to be in ohio right oh hey you know my parents are having this on sunday oh sorry i'm going to be in uh indiana you know like after a while they're going to say you know what this isn't working you're never around you know but for her to be with me beforehand i think is a big reason why it's uh working yeah, on that on that aspect, Nick, I think you outkick your coverage. Uh, I love you, but I think you outkick your coverage on that one because your wife is a sweetheart. Wow, well, thank you. I'm gonna have her. I'm gonna have her hear you say that. Good. <laughs> uh, Give her a little stroke of the ego. Yeah, there you go. 